<clears throat> what up y'all? So uh, here's the question today. He writes, hey Lloyd, love your channel. Hope you can help me out with this problem. I've been, I've been improving my results with women over the last few months and have been getting more female attention lately, which is great. However, the girls I get attention from are like sixes and sevens out of 10. And I really want to get those nines and tens. Tell me how to do well with those women. Like I said, I have no problem with these women I find less attractive, but I want to do better. Thanks so much. All right, so there's a lot to talk about here, <laughs> um, but we'll start with a few things. Um, so in this video, I'm gonna cover probably how, this guy's probably not thinking about things in the right way, um, so we'll talk about that. Uh, but also too, I'm gonna actually answer this guy's question and give you a step-by-step -step process. I actually have something that I did uh, a couple weeks ago that I think is pretty applicable to the situation. Okay, so the first thing, dude, is that uh, you want to stop thinking about women in terms of numbers, okay? Numbers out of 10, okay? And I know we're just talking about maybe a certain aspect of them, whatever, maybe just their appearance, I don't know. Uh, but if you think about things in terms of numbers, like, oh, she's a six, she's a seven, okay? And we all do this in some way, shape, or form, but try and get away from that if you can, because if you start thinking about people in terms of numbers, you're gonna start thinking of yourself as a number two, and that's not really the best for building confidence, because think life is more complicated than that, okay? So what I would encourage you to do is write down what a nine or 10 uh, is for you. What is a nine out of 10 for you? What is a 10 out of 10 for you? What kind of qualities does this person possess? Now, <laughs> you're probably a young guy and I'm literally just guessing, but my guess is that she's probably just a really hot girl, okay? Maybe she's got a bunch of followers on Instagram, maybe not, I don't know. The fact of the matter is she's probably really hot. She's probably desired, that's the key word, desired by a lot of men, okay? So this is woman is very sought after. They wanna sleep with her. They, a lot of guys wanna date her. A lot more guys wanna date and sleep with these women then probably want to date, uh, date and sleep with a six or seven. But honestly, you know, that doesn't mean that they're a better fit for you, okay? Um, so let's talk about how you can get these women that are sought after by more men, okay? Basically, you gotta be better options than those other guys, okay? So write down all of the qualities that this, this woman possesses. How many of those qualities do you yourself possess? That's a tough question here, you know? <laughs> if this woman has a lot of followers on Instagram, she's really, really hot. Are you really, really hot? Do you have a lot of followers on Instagram? Okay, my guess is you probably don't or you might not be watching or asking this video, okay? So what can you do to compensate for the fact that you don't have those things? Well, you can be, uh, you can be really rich for one, really rich and successful, that would be one thing. Um, but you're probably not that. So let's assume that you're not, you're, you're not that and you're just working with what you have right now. Like you're a normal guy, okay? Well, you can develop a high level of confidence, know how to treat people, be more charismatic, a smooth talker, be able to lead better, all the stuff that I talk about on this channel. My guess is you've done a little bit of that and you probably haven't, there's probably a lot of work I can I give you there, but um, there's kind of a limit that you can have in terms of the way you behave towards somebody, your demeanor, uh, to get them attracted to you. Women are looking for other things in addition to that as well too. And one of the things that they look for, which is probably the easiest way that you can get if you're not rich and successful, um, is uh, a little bit of social status, okay? And if you really wanna get the most sought after women, a lot of social status helps particularly with young women, okay? They go, especially if you're in college, like popularity is one of the easiest ways to be successful with women. Like if you wanna get laid a lot in college and you're popular, like that's the way to do it. Okay, but if you wanna get those kinds of women and you're an adult, um, you wanna have a higher level of social status. And how do you get a higher level of social status? Just be able to lead groups and lead things socially. Okay, I just did this today, to, uh, not today, um, like a few weeks ago, uh, I was in LA and I spent around two to three hours uh, on the beach, on Venice Beach, just talking to people. And I got a bunch of phone numbers from women, probably like six or something like that, six or seven. And I invited them all to, you know, a little bit of a kickback that I had at my hotel room later. And it was like me, my buddy, and like seven or eight really attractive women. Two of them were models. Okay, I put myself in a position 
where I led everybody to some fun. We had a little, we had a good time. Everybody hung out. Everybody got to know each other. We played some games, and I was like kind of the center of attention because I made everything happen. So my recommendation for you, dude, would be to maybe organize or practice organizing events and fun things for people. They'll see you as more of a social leader. They'll see you as more of an authoritative figure, very attractive for women. And that's the way that you compensate for these other things that you don't have, okay? So try doing some, something like that. And by the way, if you want more information about how I went to Venice Beach and did that, it's all gonna be in the approaching system. That's the, that's the product that I'm coming out with. It probably is gonna be released at the end of August, like early September time. So if you wanna get notified about that, there's a link in the description box below, uh, click on that. Uh, but that's my recommendation for you, man. That's really how you do it is you wanna create some sort of um, social status. Because women are, they don't really, like when you go out and you're looking for all the hot girls, that's not, really how women uh, think about things okay um, they're looking to see what other people are looking at and if everyone's looking to you people are responding to you well they can see that you're the guy who's kind of running stuff um, that makes you very very attractive okay there's a reason why famous people you know have no shortage of options when it comes to women you know they say like being rich will get you like two to three times more women fame will get you like you know 50 to 100 times and that's because of that. Um, it's, it's very powerful. You know, social status really matters um, in these cases. Uh, but again, dude, what I would recommend, you're probably a young guy, you want to look for the actual qualities of the person and find things to do or interest and meet people through that because you're probably going to get a much better girl. But look, dude, if you want to go for the vanity, and <laughs> trust me, I've been there, dog. <laughs> I've been there. Um, that's how you do it. That's, that's basically how you do You want to create, like, um, some some sort of event or something like that, that you're running. And that's how you do it. If you're not rich, you're not famous, um, and you, you're kind of lacking in those other areas, that's how you kind of even, even the playing field a little bit. Um, you'll, you'll be an attractive option for them. You will get, be getting a lot of female attention from that. Cool. Well, that's my answer, you guys. If you made it today, consider subscribing. I come up with videos like this every single week. Um, subscribe. And uh, yeah, that's just one idea, by the way, you guys. That's one example. Um, there are many examples that you can pick from. And uh, yeah, I cover that more in the approaching system. But I thought I'd just give you a quick answer right here on YouTube. So thanks for watching, you guys. I'll see you soon. Good luck out there.